F double R, F double R, F double R, F double R. Gotta bring that energy. Gotta bring that energy. What's going on, F double R fans? If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you've been here, welcome back to F double R. Friend request reviews for friend request friends to watch the boys season three episode one titled payback i've been waiting for this show for a very very long time and i'm so excited that we have a channel where we can bring this to life i can't wait i really can't wait to dive in me and formal right now are gonna talk a little bit about what we hope to see in season three so i can't i can't wait to see you know what what we're really gonna get into in this season because there was a few questions that i had going in you know to the finale of season two so one mm -hmm. of them is like okay are we ever gonna see homelander's son come back into the fold again that's mm -hmm. one of the questions that i have because it's just you know we send them off with with uh the men in black so i'm curious how that's gonna play out are we ever gonna see him again uh you know play into the story because obviously you know a homelander was invested so i'm kind of see if he's still invested or did he just let that go and then of course well how we ended the season two was with uh uh what was her name veronica victoria victoria, victoria Newman. yes exactly that's how we we end up discovering she was the one who's been popping the heads and mm -hmm. huey goes in and uh you know ends up getting interviewed by her and you know obviously he's gonna take the job so i'm curious how that's gonna play out because you know they separated from the boys mm -hmm. so i'm just really curious what, what how they're gonna play around with that yeah i wonder what's her motive just in general like yeah i wonder like what's her motive and and like does anyone have information on her like because most of the heroes are like documented you know like yep. even when before she killed the head of the church <clears throat> he yeah. was like, we got plenty of information on plenty of soups, like, and I'm just like, does he know who she is? Like, does he know she's a soup, or is she a naturally born soup? And maybe Ryan isn't the first naturally born soup. What if she's the first naturally born soup, and and she's just been kind of hidden away this whole time? Like, mm. so I was I was kind of curious about that. And that Homelander situation, I'm curious if we're gonna see like an injustice kind of situation going on with Homelander really Ooh. soon because season one he was coddled, you know, by by old girl, and his whole thing is you know needing to be loved and 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 appreciated like that's that's what gets him off. But he ends up killing her, which is a big step for him. But then in season two he has old dude, you know, transforming into her, you know, so he can still kind of get his rocks off. But even then, when he kills him in that scene, he says, I don't need you. I don't need nobody to love me. But we see throughout the season, he still does need people to love him. That's why he tripped out on Stormfront mm. over the memes and all that. Yep. And then at the end, Maeve was able to blackmail him with the same thing. Like, you need these people to love you. I'm going to show him this. So it worked. But I feel like he's getting closer and closer to not giving up about <laughs> people loving him. Yeah. And I feel like that's what that masturbation scene was kind of pushing us more towards like mm. i can do what i want i could do this on my own like i don't need nobody to love me so if homelander gets to that point where he don't even care like where he really don't care because he told Maeve, i'll destroy everything and everybody <laughs> you better stop playing with me so I, man i'm i'm juiced to get into this season bro I, oh my oh, gosh listen i got so much i'm so glad that we starting this on the channel uh, unfortunately, you know, we, we're not doing season one, season two. Maybe, you know, in a couple years later down the line when we done did everything and shit, we might go back. You know what I'm saying? But for now, let's dive into the season three, man. I'm ready, man. So if you haven't already, yo, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, and also don't forget to subscribe, okay? The goal is 1K. Only way we're going to get there is if you click that button and also click that bell so you get notified when we go live. Let's get it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. The boys is back in town. The boys is back in town. <laughs> Here we go. Wait, what? It's got to be a movie. He says it's got to be a movie. Oh, yeah, they do be doing movies. Yeah. Huh? Uh huh. Is that Storm? 
can't move you. That's her power? It's somebody else. It's not even her. Yeah, it's got to be a movie. Starlight. Oh my God! Look who it is. How could you do this? You'll always be in my heart. <laughs> the Fourth Reich is in my soul. <laughs> <laughs> the Fourth Reich is in my soul. <laughs> that fool at the opening watching them. They all there. Dang! Look how they. Look at how Goose that was watching. Yo, you feel bro? me? What's up, bro? This dude tuning everything out. Damn. Bruh, that's how he was when he gave his speech, though. Oh, yeah. Same thing. With Yui, too? Oh, shit. They public, man. Super public. Facts. Buddy. Hey, Nadia. It's been over Audio. Uh -oh. when are we gonna see you on there we go yeah what was that Huey picked up on it exactly calling her son it's a different name but it's been over <laughs> look at vault the moon though <laughs> it's like telemundo <laughs> i never noticed that i'm just a man who fell for the wrong woman you know who sounds like that? Amber Heard's lawyer. Yeah. Dang, it's been a year. For everyone to meet the real me. The mm. eyeballs, bro. Yo. You feel me? Dumb eyes. Oh. Hey, she out here getting. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, my man said I had to reshoot all your. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mmm, they wild with it. <laughs> Her they started crying. Wow. They have. Thanks for coming. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> yes. Watch this shit. Exactly. Take that. Get some soap, my dude. <laughs> Did he join that little task force that they were gonna Reunion. put together? I found that little asshole we've been on all month. Hey, the duel's back. I wonder how much of the sign language he learned from her. What are we watching? You already know some wild stuff. <laughs> oh, she's now the <laughs> what the hell am I looking at? Is that the small dude that turns small and he's inside a dollhouse just fucking a... a <laughs> I, I think so. I'm pretty sure that's what we just looked at. Oh my God, someone get a hot iron and put it in my eyeballs. <laughs> Oh. Fuck? And why is this is happening? Like we supposed to just be comfortable with this? Okay, I'm like, what? Hey. Always. I want you inside me. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> His whole body. This shit is wild. They not about I'm to show you, this. I'm mad you just called that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> my man really just called that. Like, they not really about to do this. Ain't no fucking no, they, way. They really are about to do this. We He's about, about to, to go. Trip. Oh, oh my oh, god. Oh no, I ain't seen nothing. <laughs> <Holy> <laughs> about to... <laughs> no way. Yo, we about to watch the whole no journey, way. man. No fucking way this is happening. <laughs> I love Did you hear his voice? <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Was that? This is not happening. This, this is, is not happening. happening. And they well, and we on the inside we in camera the inside. And... No. Bro, why do I feel like he's gonna Don't get say big it don't for some reason? Say like, I don't know why he's gonna revert back to his regular He's gonna sneeze? Oh I told you oh, just murdered him. Yo. Holy shit. They always wildin'. They always wildin' out. Wait. You can't leave. Oh shit. Close that door. Exactly. You Dip. Be... Nigga. Damn. Oh. He still got some strength on him too. He like he like Ant-Man, bro. Oh He's going gosh. up your pants. No. He's going Man, up you your better... pants. He's going... Put your hand. No, Get out. No. Get out. Get out. Don't let that, please. Oh my gosh, you got it. She could take this all day. How are you gonna shoot that thing? Go. The eyesight of <laughs> Damn. Oh, 
threw him in a ziplock. Yo, threw him in a baggie. Is that cocaine? <laughs> like a, I don't know, but he, he threw him, him in, in like cocaine. A fairy, bro. He threw like him in cocaine. Pixie. That's crazy. Cool up bureau. Oh shit. He has to. Yeah, he's part of that agency, remember? That they built out at the wow. end of season two. Wow. Look at the restraint on No yep. way, but it's you got a new that butch. Of... Yo. It's a new butch. <laughs> Yo. I can't believe Yo, that was wild. How surveillance go with termite last night? You know, I haven't checked in with Butcher yet, but I'm sure it went fine. <laughs> no. Don't, no, don't give me that. Face. Exactly. Like hundred dollar bill, something got fucked up. Well, I mean, it wasn't his fault. Butch didn't. At least Butch didn't slap his ass through that table. <laughs> Are we though? Oh my god! So worth the herpes. <laughs> okay, I wasn't re expecting this relationship. Yeah. Can I help you? She's very bubbly. She got a cool personality. Man. There we go, Nadia again. Yep, Second yep. Time. That's same Congress dude. Victoria Newman. This could be the key to Tell find me. out. Who she is. She'll remember. She'll remember. Yeah, come on, Hugh. Hugh, come on. Pick up on this, man. Like, you're not picking exactly. up on this? Exactly. You, you've been hunting supers with the boys for two seasons, brudger. There you go. Look. Hey. <laughs> and he was an old girl, going, too. So she got, her, she got herself a kid back. <laughs> Mom used to help. Hmm. She was really good at math. She was a clever one. Until you threw the laser beam through her neck, bruh. It's your fault. It's not his fault. You was taking those crocodile tears. You accepted those. Are you telling me you're a butch? <laughs> you safe here with the colonel? With the colonel. Damn, he's scared. Maybe there's hope for you, too. I don't know. I shouldn't get too close to him. <clears throat> I'll just fuck it up. Oh, oh you man. Straight and narrow all year. Marvin did get out. Will, is, is, uh, will we see Mother's Milk at all this season? Will he come back? Nah, if we don't see Mother's Milk, I'm tight. It was a fucked up mistake. That talent booker is so fucking fired. I'm asking him. I'm asking mm. him. <laughs> you already know, Mr. Homelander spoke. Everybody's quiet. I, I, I should never go before you. Obviously, I'm a nobody compared to you. you want to know a secret? I didn't even write the fucking book. Shia LaBeouf's ghostwriter did. <laughs> <laughs> Homeland is a hey. scary dude. What was that? I actually mean pretty well. Oh, she don't know better. She's one of those. She one of those. You need yeah. to stand up for yourself. Go ahead, stand up <laughs> against Superman. Him. Yeah, see what happens. Remember when Homeland smacked old boy's ears? That blind dude. <laughs> He's a cold dude. That sounded really good. Man, look at his fate, bruh. He killing this part, man. He's he's always been great at Homelander, though, but he killing it. There you go. Mother's milk. Mother's milk. Let's this. go. What? Stepfather Todd? I guess so. <laughs> yep. Oh my gosh. When did this happen? You remember she said she would never mess with him again? Great time Sorry. to bring this up, bro. Happy birthday. I mean. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's Homelander of all people. <laughs> Ooh, I would have to go home. It's not even that. That man was so short. I'm sorry. <laughs> He looked like one of the kids. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, so he is kind of short. <laughs> one dose of this temporary V gives a soldier 24 hours of powers. Give wow. Him. They're making and temporary they compound. Right back to normal. How stable is it? Still ironing out the kinks, the fame, the movies, the mm -hmm. depraved sex. Yep. You ruined them. Cone of silence. In five years, I hope to be out of the superhero business entirely. Mm. Shit. 
I still have a few stringers that I can pull in comics. I mean, not only did they use a Nazi to sell it, a Nazi created no, that no, shit. No, 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 no. Come that on. That transition really? right there. He said, I still got a couple strings I can pull and it went straight to her. You, you and I built this place. And we did it the right way without being covered in blood and guts. That's what he asked right. for at the end of the season, too. Yep. He said, I want to do it differently. I still want to fight the suits. Yes. Yeah. Then you're a fucking twerk. Huey, you're working with Vaughn. I'm... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> you working with them too, though, Butcher. Y'all yes, all yes. under the thumb now. Like... Facts. Y'all not really the boys no more. Boy, just... <laughs> Look at he him. Is. Yeah, that sounded great. He's definitely at his lowest, man. He's not killing soups like he wants to. He doesn't have Becca. Like the squad is dismantled. You feel me? This yeah. ain't the life that he lives, man. This ain't butts. He hasn't said diabolical yet. <laughs> Are you at your boiling point right now? We left the rest of them to fucking die. No, you stay back. He's gonna release it, yo. Yep. Bro, don't. Like you said, the boiling point, the teapot. Yeah. Okay. He's <laughs> <laughs> yo, what's up, Homelandy? Which is why the board wants to make you co captain of the seven. What? Ooh. Wow. Co captain? <clears throat> <laughs> No, thank you. If anybody, it should be Maeve. Well, Maeve doesn't have a 96. Nobody does. Except you, apparently. Exactly. <laughs> I guess he do still care about all that shit. It's gonna snap eventually, though. You know that he can, he can probably hear you. Good. I hope he does. Hmm. <laughs> Yo! Gustavo not playing. He a G. Nah, Edgar, we gonna respect this man and call him what he needs to be called. That's Stan, bruh. Stan Edgar. I am offering you real power. You should think about it. It's quite a step up from last season. Will it Super be supersonic? Sonic. He first exploded onto the scene as Drummer Boy. <laughs> Drummer Boy? Wasn't that the hero? Starlight started dating. That was her first boyfriend. When he broke hearts everywhere by dating a certain rising star yep. on the <laughs> right there. <laughs> Please hang up your cape and go. Mm. <laughs> I mean, sex, sex. We did a ton of butt stuff. Wow. <laughs> oh, whoa. <Fuck> you. <laughs> <laughs> now, that was funny because that's like the stereotypical, like, yes. religious mm -hmm. gateway. Like, it's not sex, you know? I mean, I could bring good people into the seven who could help me. Wait, you mean like your boyfriend? Damn. Come on. You Huey. did not just say Damn. that. You did not just How say did that. that. You feel me? How did that conversation even. Here we go, taking the pictures. Uh oh, she looking very nervous. Man. Here we go. <laughs> this dude is gonna. <laughs> what episode is it gonna be? It gotta be episode four. I don't four. know. But he is gonna. You think I haven't seen you? Shoving back two dozen cupcakes in the break room. Mm. Nine servings on Miro's truffle risotto night. Fastest man alive. What a fucking joke. He do look a little what tubby under that suit. I didn't mean it. <laughs> Say it to somebody. I'm sorry. Damn. This has gotta be uh Nah, this is real. Homeland is cracking. It's it's happening. This is the season. Tell me we're gonna see some injustice shit, man. This, this dude is, gonna is gonna be wild crazy. Out. This is gonna be crazy. Mm. Yeah, he watched the whole thing go down. Look, he do look a little tubby. They it look like they <laughs> added some cushioning in his suit or something like Storm Chaser supporters. Oh, I didn't think there we were gonna go. get a scene with it. Wonderful. Okay, she's back to speaking English. People. Wow. She gonna give him a handy. Oh, that video over my head month after month. <sighs> I took my son from. <laughs> you gotta lower her down real quick so it could fit perfectly in the hand. Dang. Yo, this show is fucking crazy. <laughs> this 
This show is fucking crazy. Yo. I think I have something. Now it explains why he has the video. The video, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yep. If we can find this weapon or whatever it is, maybe we can use it to blow Homelander's fucking brains out. Hmm. Hmm. But how the hell y'all gonna find that? What's this? It's 10 what? feet. One shot makes you a soup for 24 hours. Is that shit stable, <gasps> though? Can you trust taking that? I mean, they think. Exactly, they think. Exa thank you for telling them that, at least. To Homelander, really? Had to be. He's my son, William. My family. I'm gonna find him. A little more... Scorched Earth. Hmm. Shock Scorched and Earth. Shock and all. Shock and all. Blood and bone. Oh, nah. And in the end, only one of us left standing. Only one of us left standing. Brad, Homelander versus Butch. Butch with powers. Oh my God. I wonder what bro. powers Butch is going to get. Bro, this episode of hers. Die of fucking Bollicle. Yes, sir. He ain't going nowhere, but he, he definitely keeping tabs. Soldier Boy. That dude, Soldier Boy, he's from Supernatural. The actor, at least. Nadia. Mm. He about to get his head popped. Yo, if he does, oh shit! First episode. If we see it. Yeah, first episode, bro. We there? Let's go! I'm ready. We were best friends. That was a long time ago, Tony. What's a long time? How many years? We should tell everyone. Powers too, though. He said, "If I'm going, I'm going first. Oh, there it is. Ooh, oh, oh, it's whatever hand. she looks at. Yup, she got that thing, boy. That's why he's trying to keep her head. Yeah, down. Okay. yeah, I would too. Don't let her look at you. Mmm, mm. oh, shit. She is Yo. sexy, bro." So wow. sexy. Bro, her powers are crazy. Can you imagine? Just. Yo. Oh mm. my mm -mm -mm. God. Come on, Tony. Why'd you do that, bro? Ooh. Oh, shit. Get That's rid of it all. Yo, that shit scared me. <laughs> Get rid of it all. I need it. I need a team. Hmm. Huh. Alleyway. East 12th and Broadway. Hmm. Huh. Wow. First episode, they freaking get straight to it. Let's go, baby. Hey. Uh, she is a bad, Tower. bad chick. She oh, is a bad bitch. I, man, she is fine, bro. No, she is. I right, There we have it. Episode one in the books. I gotta say this episode was a great, 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 great episode. Got into a lot of things. How, what's your thoughts about this episode, Formal? Curious. <laughs> I'm just curious. How you feeling? I mean, it was a solid. It was a solid first episode. I think every season premiere of the boys. It, it gets pretty gruesome like they, that's a very common thing i mean pretty much every episode for the most part can get pretty litty but like they they let you know like how gruesome the show can be always on that first premiere and you know i think we had a little bit of fun we've seen what people are doing it's been like a year after uh the season finale of uh, season two and um you know we got a couple of couple of questions that I was thinking about that we were thinking about that's already being answered. So like, yep. uh, did they ever build out that bureau? It looks like they did, right? Huey's there working for it. Butcher's also there working. Um, Marvin Milk, you know, I mean, yeah, Marvin Milk, he retired and stuff. And but it looks like he 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 wants back in. Yeah. Um, Homelander, he is still going through whatever he's going through. I still think he's gonna crack. I think we're gonna get some injustice stuff. That whole little scene with him and butcher talking about scorched earths and last man standing i, I don't like, even think whew. it's not even just that scene i just 
I, th- to be honest, his performance throughout this entire episode was just uh, amazing. The, the look, is. the look on that man's eyes, it, it just it says so much. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Without him saying anything, and man, like yeah. he had the termite, <laughs> the termite go- ex- expand out of someone's penis. Yes, like. that that was. That takes the cake, in my opinion. Like yeah, we 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 were literally watching a man walk down someone's pee hole, like urethra. <laughs> yeah. And and oh freaking uh, Frenchie almost got freaking body by the dude. Like he mm-hmm. yo, I was I was feeling it for him. I was screaming with him like yo, get this man out of my pants, like. Cause this dude, this dude about to crawl up in there and do some wild shit. So, and yeah, they show man. every drop, every Everything. every organ, every intestine. <laughs> they be on it. <laughs> this should be beautiful. <laughs> but one thing I didn't expect for them to to get right into was the whole Huey and uh, keep forgetting her name, Victoria. Victoria, yeah. I didn't think they were gonna really dive into that so early. So now that. Huey kind of knows what's going on. I'm wondering what what he's gonna do with this information. Like, is yeah. he gonna bring it a butcher? And, and are they gonna take care of it? Like, what 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 we do? What, what is his next move? So I'm really curious where these next, you know, the, how the season's gonna play out. Obviously, but yeah, they 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 brought up a lot of things. One thing is the temporary. Uh, Compound V, uh, V24, mm-hmm. which is interesting because then that means that anybody, any of these characters who are human can become super for 24 hours. So I can't wait to see what they do with that. You know, I, f- I feel like they're going to do some wild, crazy stuff with that. A butcher with powers just sounds terrifying. Diabolical. Diabolical. It really does. It would be pretty wild to see Butcher with some powers, see Frenchie with some powers, Mother's Milk with some powers. Maybe even Huey, man, get some powers <laughs> for for the one time and save Starlight. For Not even time. save Starlight. He will probably use it to beat up old boy. Just to show wow. his dominance. <laughs> wow, the dude that he jealous of. <laughs> yep. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, this episode was wild though. They definitely did get into some things. We got the temp, like you said, the temporary drug out there. Mm-hmm. Um, freaking Stan Edgar seems like he's getting tired of the superhero stuff, and I think he's serious because honestly, that yes. was the trend um, for season two with with Stan too. Man, he was he was you could see it in his face every time something happened. He just like, come on, bro. Yep. Like this is what we got to deal with, and I like the way he worded it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like they gave people powers and then try to build the hero from there. Like, yep. You know what I'm saying? So it, it, I think it is a better push, at least in terms of uh, marketing and, and camp. You know, trying to uh, get your investors and stuff to campaign it the way he's trying to campaign it now. You know, mm-hmm. we got the temporary dose. You already have your heroes. We just giving them that extra boost to yep. to be super. You exactly. know, so. Yeah. They 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 be doing their thing, and honestly, that's one of the things that I like the most about the boys. Like with, because <clears throat> you know, since we didn't do season one and season two, because that's been watched and stuff like that prior to us starting the channel. Mm-hmm. So I didn't get to really talk about this, but like one of the things I love the most about the boys is that it probably feels like the realest to me when it comes to superheroes in a real world. World, yeah, like. Mm-hmm. When when season one came out, like Marvel and DC were dom. I mean, Marvel and DC has been dominating the media for for decades now, right? So when the boys came out, that shit was like a breath of fresh air for pretty much everybody, and it was hella gory and gruesome and just mm-hmm. you know adult like. So raw. everybody was drawn in raw, exactly like. So that's one of my favorite things about it, and they keep that trend going. Like the fact that these superheroes are not even naturally born like this whole time it's a pharmaceutical company that's been labbing these mugs and then mm-hmm. pretty much just hoeing they ass because that's what they doing they really whoring these dudes man yeah like, they are like the actual industry like the way that we look at i guess rappers and movie stars and stuff that's what they doing with these people and that's why i love this show so much i'm just like this feels like i feel like if there were superheroes that's how they would be getting treated some yep. rich ass company would freaking get them under locks I remember Marvel even tried to kind of play with something like that and during a civil war where they were like, yeah, we got to put ordinance on the 
superheroes, but nothing like the boys. Like this is like clear cut. Yep. We the pimps and y'all are hoes. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. And, and I love that. They worry about points and, and how the, mm -hmm. the public perceives them and all that. So yeah, I, yep. I completely agree. I think that's what makes this show unique compared to other superhero films or mm -hmm. films or TV shows, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because yep. anything. It really does home in on kind of how we live real our reality. And it and it kind of ties that in together with the superheroes. And I love it yeah. because <clears throat> the story is, you know, at first everybody thought this was God given, you know, power, but they come to find mm -hmm. out that they fabricated. So it just it mm -hmm. plays into the whole series and the whole so well. And and it right here, and right right now it's just at a pinnacle point because it seems like everybody's fed up with uh with, with Homelander. Everybody. Mm -hmm. So I'm I'm I think you're right. I think we are gonna get one of those moments where it's gonna be everybody against Homelander. You know? I feel like we I mean we, it already is. Low it key. it is, but it just is not in your face. You know, yeah, yeah, just not you know in your face. Because he hasn't but he Homelander hasn't hit that switch. It. No, you he gonna bring it. He gonna initiate it. I'm telling you, he the one that's gonna bring it. So you think he's he the one just... that's gonna initiate it, or you think something's gonna happen Damn. where they fuck up? And then he, that's when he like kind of switches. I mean, define fuck up because like they try know, to take him out, they fuck up, it doesn't work, oh, and then he goes, okay. "Okay, I'm gonna go full." Uh, you know, like they get that weapon that Maeve was just talking about, and it doesn't and then, work. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Something I was, like that. I was honestly thinking it was something as simple as a train eating another cupcake, and he just <laughs> <laughs> like because that's what I feel like that's the type of thread that Homeland is on right now. Like any he really little is. thing. It's gonna make him just, cause That's he's had he's point. had those moments like when he smacked old boy in season two, like he was just like, oh, oh, you just another blonde guy, that, like damn, like, right? Was, Did you really have he to do that? He was in front of somebody that he can manipulate, though. I feel like you know what I'm saying. When he's in front of people of power, he don't be acting that way. When he in front of Stan, how he be acting? You seen him when he was trying to run around the desk? He scooted up. He started <laughs> speed walking real quick just to get there first. But, like, <laughs> but that's cause he still cares about the public perception. That's true, Once that's that true. goes away, yeah, it's yeah. over, son. I, I, I it's believe over. I believe that we might we might see that this season. I think they might build it up this season and the season four might be that. But who knows? You know, I think right. they, they got into the whole Veronica thing pretty fast. So I feel like things yeah. are gonna be moving quickly here. But um it was interesting to see them a little bit more public, like seeing her oh, raise yeah. up to the ninety six percent and and get cho chosen as co captain. Co -captain. That's that's good. I mean that's powerful because to be honest, in season one, like, she was kind of like that person, in my opinion. Like, she does, she seemed like the type of person who would raise up in the ranks of, like, the the, the person of for Vault. Like, so mm. it is kind of interesting to see her hit that co-captain yeah. rank and have all that power in that decision. But I wonder, like, what is she actually going to do with it? She did mention, like, maybe she could pull in more heroes that will help you know join the fight against homelander and stuff like that like your boyfriend but, um <laughs> man but is it really that easy though you know what i'm saying like <laughs> yeah, or true. is she just gonna cower like she does whenever they are in front of homelander because homelander still he still got that juice they could all talk all they the talk that they want to talk behind his back yeah, yeah, but yeah. every time he in the room they know to be silent like bro, he's a scared bro that face the looks <laughs> the looks look is like what gets you like a chucky dog <laughs> And then, like a good guy, though, man. And then we got to see a person that I didn't think we were going to see, Stormfront. She was, uh, looked like she's healing up, but she looks messed up. Lost the eye, yeah. skin all burned. Yeah. And, but yeah. she's still pleasing Homelander. <laughs> she couldn't even do that. I mean, couldn't because she that. was talking. <laughs> um, yeah, reason. I mean, she's done, man. <laughs> I wonder what they're going to do with that, though, because I, I had a feeling that he was going to still go and, and, you know, talk to her. And I figured like she would eventually get into his head. But he doesn't seem very interested in that whole Nazi Aryan stuff right now. Like nah. he like he, he, you know, like he said, he he's the perfect race like he, he ain't yeah. trying to do no <laughs> white black shit. He, he already the perfect race. So I don't know what, what that's going to transpiring to like i don't know if she'll be able to get her powers back mm -hmm. or something like that like because her because like i don't know because she I'm, might she I'm might end in. up being like fucking and, and trying to take out like 
you know, a suicide mission. Who knows? Just turn this into a I bomb. No, or maybe shit. she gets some wild ass prosthetics or something and come on Ooh. some robo Nazi type <laughs> shit. Like, <laughs> like how, that's what I'm trying to. That's that's oh. what I'm trying to get at. Ultimately, like, is she gonna get up out this bed and mm. be able to whoop some ass? Like, what, what's Winter happening Soldier? with Stormfront? Hit her with the the thirteen phrases real quick. That's what I'm. That's what I'm. We're not completely sure how we're gonna release this stuff, you know. We 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 trying to um at least get the first three out out the way, but you know, time, scheduling is is always an issue. But um, yeah, man, we're gonna, we're gonna try our best to catch up and make sure we we hear weekly with the fresh and new, uh, episodes of of the boys. So with that being said, man, if you had to score this episode for them, what would you score? Um. This one was pretty cool. I think I'll get this one. I'll give it a nine because it's a season. It was a premiere. Yeah. And it was a dope ass premiere. They landed. They landed it just right. So I got to give them that extra boost right there. So I'll give them a nine. Perfect. That's exactly where I was going to land. I was like, if we give this shit an 8.5, I swear to God. <laughs> I almost was. <laughs> I I'm know just you like, was. It's a premiere. And they landed. They, I'm t- Every season, premiere was landed perfectly for the boys. Uh, yeah, season I, one, two, and three. I can't agree anymore. I think this episode landed it. And it, it, it got us in a trajectory where I can't wait to see how it's going to unfold. You know? Mm-hmm. So, man, if you're still here, man, we appreciate each and every single one of y'all. If you haven't already comment down below let us know what we miss in this episode and don't forget to subscribe f double r out peace